Okay, this is Sadie. Little hanging tree cow dog female. Um, I'm gonna send her into this brush here. There's about 19 head of heifers. <clears throat> this is exercise I do for his training uh, for a dog to actually go in to brush and find cattle. So I start them off, I just send them, whether on a hunt them up or on out. And then, you know, if, if she needs help, I will go in there and uh, help her. <clears throat> but this is just kind of what I do, a repetition of just sending them in to, to brush until they find the cattle. Then that way in the future, you know, you never know when cattle are in the brush and you may need to send your dog in. And if you don't <clears throat> work on stuff like this, they won't even know there's, that there's cattle in the in the brush. Hunt them up, hunt them up, on out. So here I just start walking this way. And if she needs help, I help her. But if not, you know, I just let her go and find them. I have no earthly idea where they are. It's probably about, I don't know, an acre, I guess. Cedar brush. So it's not like, you know, it's a big hard deal. And I know that they're in here. So I just go in with her until she finds them and, you know, and pretty much have her get, get back and try to bring them to me. And I always holler at her to get back so that way she knows exactly where I am. Now get back! Now get back! Bring them on! And she is a pretty well-started dog. I have used her. Um, maybe not in these types of situations. Uh, but not all the time. These dogs are going to be in open pasture matter of fact she found them and there they are so this is just a little training exercise i do now get back i'm not sure where she is but I guarantee she's behind them somewhere now bring them on good girl there she is good girl now bring them on hey ben i know they're there, whether I'm horseback or foot like I am now or on a side by side. I'll just head on back to the open pasture where your pens are gonna be in real life situations and just have her bring them to me. Now bring them on, bring them on. This is just a training exercise that I do. Maybe not everybody has brush to practice in or whatever but <clears throat> i always like my dogs to be real comfortable in the, in the brush don't matter where i send them they're going to go because when i send them they get to the point of knowing that i'm not going to send them just because She'll get up there and turn them. Good girl. Good girl. This is a real special little female. A lot of times I'm not just real high on females, but this one here I really like. Come by. She's a daughter of Jode out of a daughter of Chance, which I really, really like her. Ton of natural ability, plenty of bite, plenty of herd, style, works with her eyes some. Bring them on. Bring him on, Sadie. Bring him on.
Bring him on, Sadie. Good girl. Bring him on. Walk up. Good girl. Way. Here. 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 There. Good girl. Anyway, now if your pins are set up in this open pasture or whatever, you can just ride to your pins, take your cattle. You know, these are, this is a quiet set of heifers, but you know, their dog broke. They still got some trot to them. They're, I like this little set. Out. Anyway, that's, that's how I start my dogs and in going into the woods and brush finding them and I just do it over and over with them once they get to a point that you know they're used to going in the open pasture and feel comfortable about that then I'll start you know sending them into the brush and finding cattle and <clears throat> because they got to maneuver on their own and I try not to tell them a whole lot but but anyway that's that's how I start my dogs going into the brush finding cattle because in this part of the country as well as you can see you know it's very very beneficial and other parts of the country is too you know because they're not all in the open pasture come good girl that'll do that'll do that'll do there down good girl